So now let us look at the human evolution, how the human evolution took place. For thousands of years, there is no evolution in the Homo sapiens species. The same Homo sapiens species is continued in all the various continents. Of course, if we see the ancestor of all the humans, it is the same ancestor and we all have come from our homeland that is the Africa. But now if you see the people of different country, you find different races, Americans, whites and blacks, Negroes, Chinese, Japanese, Indians. So all these have different skin color, different features, but the DNA, it remains same and all these different races they can reproduce one with the other, interracial reproduction is possible. So it shows that we are all same species again. But we all started as a common ancestor that is the Homo sapiens is found in Africa. So from the Africa, some people they spread in the Africa and some migrated to West Asia, from there to Central Asia, there to Eurasia, to South Asia and to East Asia. And from there to Indonesia, Philippines, Australia and there to America. In this way, the spread of the people, population, human population has taken place. So this was happened in groups because people were nomadic. Humans were nomadic, just moving in groups. Sometimes they may move forward, sometimes they may move backward. It is a haphazard movement. So in this haphazard movement, they have spread all over the planet. Now we are able to meet the people of various continents but even then still the genetic material of course there are some differences in the genetic sequences of all these various races but still they are able to reproduce with the other races. So every organism in this planet we see it's uh, the evolution is a continuous process and whatever the organisms are existing now they are making their life, they are living their life in a better way with all the variations that they have acquired. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.